Hey, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, my name is Alvita Patrice. And most mornings, this is my beautiful drive to work. And I just wanted to share a couple of days in my life and enjoy the video. So I'm headed to work and yeah, I know I look crazy, but um, I finally finished braiding my hair and um, long hair don't care. Like it's super long, but it's really, really cute. So, but yeah, um, this drive to work is like a road trip every freaking day. I'm like, I'm so over this drive so over it um but i'm in the process of making some major changes in my life and i'm ready for it i feel like these last six months i've just been sitting back and like at the back of the crowd you know like not really doing anything And it's time to move forward and move on and new adventures like there's so much that I want to do but I get in my head and I don't do anything I have a lot of potential and things that I know I can do great at and I'm a perfectionist I want things to be perfect and I know it's not going to be perfect. It's never going to be perfect. And I just need to get my life together. Because right now it is in shambles. And a few people in my life, you know, have little snippets of like what's really going on. I mean, they don't know the entire like detail detail i will never tell anyone anything the only person i talk to with in intimacy like that is god so but you know he know already so it's not but anyway um but yeah my life is in shambles right now so i'm trying to pick up the pieces but you know some of the pieces are going to be left because it's just too many to pick up and some of them I don't want to pick up so um, but hopefully today at work it's not too bad it's going to be hot the last couple of days it's been like 100 degrees <laughs> super hot that's why I got my hair up in this like in this bun thing because it's super hot and I can't be dealing with this hair and all of that so but I will check back when I probably when I get ready to get it and get into work and get going so yeah so I am finished with the work and you can see the sweat and hard labor I put in for today and I'm still looking like a ninja um, but yeah, I am ready to go. It's hot and I'm off tomorrow. <clears throat> but I was helping this guy. He was like, he like old school. He probably like in his 60s. But he asked me how many youngins, youngins, something about some youngins. Basically asking me how many kids I got. And I was just like, what in the world are you talking about? And he was like, uh, you know I'm old school. You know I'm old school. I'm like, youngins? What is a youngin? This is very peaceful and calming uh, listening to the birds watching the squirrels run around I really enjoy this alone time just being by myself and reflecting on my life and choices that I have made and that I need to make really enjoy being out here so I'm out 
taking a walk. Usually on Sundays, I get up and I clean and I go for a five mile walk run. I don't really do the run so much because you know, I have asthma and I'm not trying to have an asthma attack out here. So, but yeah, it's a beautiful day. The sun is shining and it's nice to be out. Um, I might go get the kids today. I'm not sure because them two kids right there, I love them more than I love myself, but and they two Scorpios together? Oh my gosh. Oh, but they're fun to hang out with, laugh and talk. So, but yeah, I'm gonna finish this walk. It's probably gonna take like an hour or so. So yeah, but this is where I'm at. I'm gonna show you guys where I am at. And they have these little little workout stations right here if you want to do like a workout I never stop but it's super nice and this park has been here for a couple years so but yeah So this is the park where the kids love to come and play football and ride on their hoverboards, which we haven't done in a while. And also there's a water park where there's little instruments and things that's coming out of the ground that has water. It's really cool with all the exercise. Um, there's a picnic table. You have a lot of birthday parties. And this is the park where they like to go and play in the water. The water park doesn't open till 10. So I just finished my <clears throat> five run walk um, at the park earlier. And I was having like an asthma attack. I honestly, y'all, I had to use my inhaler because I was coughing and like short of breath. So, I took my medicine, I went and got something to drink, and I'm about to go <clears throat> take a shower and um, <clears throat> clean out my car, get it washed, and probably go somewhere. And um, I need to journal and write down my <clears throat> plans for the week and Just be away from the crib, basically, because I don't want to be there. And um, if you know, you know. So, but <clears throat> it's a beautiful day to be out and about. I did text the kids to see if they wanted to hang out today. Their mom did not respond, so um, I'm not gonna wait around. It would be nice to hang out with them today, but <clears throat> I gotta keep it moving because I am trying to get my life back on track because <clears throat> we've been broke down for too long. Broke down on the side of the road for too long so it, it's time it really is time so i will check back later once i take a shower let my hair down and yeah i will be back so i've taken a shower and i kind of semi got 
dressed. I mean, I didn't do much, but wash my face, put on like some mascara and a little concealer. And I got me a protein shake. And I think I'm gonna be going to Goodwill because I have these shoes that I wanna um, make into like jeans, sandals. You know, if you know what I'm talking about, I'll put a picture up showing like jean um, slides that people either buy, which are ridiculously overpriced. But I'm gonna DIY and make my own. So I'm gonna go to Goodwill and find some cheap, um, like cheap, cheap jeans, some different des like design, different sizes of jeans. I have some already, but I'm supposed to be making a purse for my friend in Alaska, which is completely overdue. She sent me some jeans like I know it's been like a year she sent me those jeans and I have done nothing with them, which I feel bad about. But we are gonna get there, we're gonna get there. So, um, but yeah, I'm gonna go to the Goodwill or, or the consignment shop <clears throat> and find some jeans and so yeah and then i'm gonna write out my week and plan some things that i need to get done to get my life back on track because as i said before you know we're broke down on the side of the road um with no kind of plan right now so but i'll check back when i get um in the goodwill and kind of show you guys what i picked up so So this Goodwill didn't really have much. I was looking at the men's jeans, the kids' jeans, and just looking for like different styles. Um, basically, I was looking for the size because I wanted a lot of working material. So in case I cut up everything, and um, and also looking for the tag on the jeans that were um, on sale. So. They didn't have much that I was looking for, but I did pick up a few things. So I just left Goodwill and I picked up like three pair of men jeans they were like size 40 size 38 and then a pair of kids because i liked the levi's logo um and i did get all the jeans that i got were um like on sale because if you know the goodwill you have like a tag each day or each week. There's a green, red, blue, white, like tag on the pants or item you're getting. And they have 40% off. So every time I shop at Goodwill, unless it's just like a steal steal and I just have to like get it. Um, I always get the tag with the discount. So you get the extra 40% off. So I spent like $18 and some change for those um, four items because I did get the men's because I want them to be bigger because I plan on making like some wallets and some keychains. So I don't want to seam in some of the items that I make um, because if you get them in like my size, the bags aren't going to be really that big. So I'm going to be making those and I will keep you guys posted and so today I'm just like I'm just out and about I don't have any plans to like do anything I'm gonna be I'm going to TJ Maxx right now 
probably won't get anything but I'm just looking I'm literally just wasting my day so if you know you know so I'll check back later I'm not really sure why I'm even looking at purses. I don't need a purse, but this is super cute. It's orange, and I don't know if I would really even wear that because it has to be specific to your outfit, but they're super cute. So I'm getting my car washed. I do have like this plan where you can go literally every day and clean out your car, but it's been raining every day. So I think it's just a waste. I don't know if it's a waste of me paying for the plan or a waste of me getting my car wash and it's dirty the next day, but it's cool to get your car washed every day because you know, it's clean, so. So I am up, it's Monday morning, and I thought they were gonna like text me to come into work today, but I'm kind of glad they haven't because I really don't want to go. I got a lot of stuff that I need to do, and I'm going to the gym, and I think
you come get the cold sore look. I don't know. It just, it's like this little like bump on my lip, which it wasn't there last night. It wasn't there yesterday. So, um, but yeah, uh, I don't have much going on today. Um, a couple things I got to get done that I've been procrastinating on. And I'm going to go to probably like Starbucks and sit there and really get all of my passwords and everything like written down because I go to try to log into certain things and I don't know the password then I get locked out and then it's asking me to send a code to a phone that was disconnected almost a month ago so yeah um, but I will check back once I get done at the gym. Not sure if I'm going to film in the gym or not, but we will see. So, because I've never been to the gym. To me, this is late because I'm usually in the gym like 5 o'clock in the morning. And I'm going to probably get there probably like 7 30 and yeah i'll check back later so bye so i just left the gym and i don't know i just wasn't feeling like working out like my mind is everywhere and i've got things i need to do i'm just not in the right mental space today i'm not really even sure why um so yeah, I gotta go to the bank because something's going on with my account. It's locked up for some reason. And then I'm gonna go get me an acai bowl, I think. I don't know, I bought the stuff to make my own. So I might save that $15 and just wait and make my own. But I've got to go somewhere with the internet and start retrieving and writing down all of my passwords and getting them together because I am a hot mess. Everything is in shambles since my phone was disconnected. Why did this lady, she just got out of a, out of a car, car right here. She just got out of that car and then she got into this other car with all these bags. Like, what's up with that? But anyway, let me get out that lady's business and get into my own business. So yeah, I'm about to go to the bank and see what's up with that. And um, yeah, I will check back later. So I just got off of work and um, Yesterday, I didn't come back because I got a call from my son that he needed. Basically, he was hungry and thirsty. So, I ended up taking him some food and drinks. And I end up getting a, I don't know if this is a cold sore, but look at that. I got like this bump on my lip. And I'm trying not to let it like pop but it looked like I got hit in the lip so yeah I've got some like medicine on it and um but yeah I am I just got off from work and I got wet as ever I didn't have any rain gear I had an umbrella it helped out just a little bit but um just continue this vlog probably until like Saturday and start a new one on Sunday. And this week I've been trying to get all of my passwords retrieved, get my phone number changed. And I didn't mention it earlier, but if I did, 
situations where my phone was disconnected and I didn't change I didn't have time to change over a lot of my login and a lot of your logins they send you a text message like a code to verify that it's you and you have access to the phone and I can't change a lot of that and also changing my address it's just been a lot and I don't have time to be on the phone while I'm at work and it slows me down and my mind is like on personal stuff and not work stuff and it just throws me off and then when I get off I want to like relax my body and my mind because I've been learning to meditate and relax my mind from like all the things that's going on and not be up half the night thinking and worrying and planning and all of this stuff so um what are they doing hmm. but yeah i'm working on you know getting all of my passwords in one place, I don't want all my passwords to be the same thing because, you know, that's how people hack into your stuff when they figure it out. And it's just, I have too many logins and I have too many passwords to remember. And you want them to be long and difficult so people can't like figure out what your password is. And it's just been stressful not having a phone and not having my old phone number and having to change everything but you know what it was for the better you know I don't really care about not having the number and the reasons why I don't have the number I really don't care so you know it is what it is so and I'm gonna let it be what it is and um, but yeah I'm gonna stop rambling and I'll probably I might pick up the camera later but then more than likely I probably won't so I will um, check back later look at Aiden he is super cute he is so smart he was the valedictorian for his kindergarten class um, and he loves to sing watch YouTube so but that is it. This is another um, boring day in my life. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And enjoy this beautiful sunset. I hate the drive, but I also enjoy it equally to watch such a beautiful um sight you really don't get that it's different every single day and i completely enjoy it and it just renews my faith to continue to do the things that i love and just get it done thank you again for watching and i will see you in the next one bye